agile. Yeah. You know, first off, what is agile? Right. What are the, what are the basic concepts of agile? And second, you know, you always hear agile. Well, I shouldn't say you always, but agile seems to be inexorably linked to DevOps. Does it does it need to be? Is that just the nature of? Yeah. It, 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 is agile part one of the drivers to DevOps? Well, I think in as much as I think if you think of what the goal of, to me, uh, the goal of agile, you know, and the agile process is um, uh, comes from similar motivations to how I, I tried to frame DevOps as this yep. thing, you know, about a uh, kind of more of a continual fluid change model. Right. And, you know, and agile similarly, um, I think it didn't come from the from the technical operations side. It came from the kind of more of the how we how do we manage our engineering process side but the idea with agile being like um you know you should uh you know you should create create a culture where you have you know smaller more manageable iterations of work uh, and a culture where you um share that work and get and test that work with customers um you know early and often you know i mean i think most people have been part of software projects where um, it's easy to kind of put your head in the sand and you're, you're behind, you want to get stuff done, you spend months and months building some software and then it, you release it and like people don't, you're like, well, I don't, I don't want to, this doesn't meet my requirements anymore or I don't like using this. Um, and I think, you know, um, certainly, you know, uh, and I think Agile was an attempt to um, kind of inject more reasonable kind of iterative methodologies into the way we think about a uh, software so like um let's let's not put all even if let's not put all our hopes around like testing something with customers in two years how do we how do we kind of plan out our work so that you know we can get value to customers in a in a short amount of time and in a few weeks or you know a few months and how do we how do we kind of recognize the fact that like we might think we know the requirements of our system now, but the reality is that like in two months, like we'll we'll have talked to 10 new customers and like we'll have realized, oh, well, that wasn't a good idea or we actually have to do this other thing or like, you know, and we don't want to be locked into a plan where we can't now react to those requirements for, you know, for, for months on end. So I to me, the reason that these concepts are linked is that it's a similar, Agile was re reacting to a similar need to kind of figure out how do we be more more fluid, how do we create a process that kind of embraces more continual repeated change than you know, maybe a traditional software development um, methodology?